Hey guys, Bruno here. Welcome back to Grandad's Farm here in No Man's Land for a very cold, wintry January morning. Um, there's not much we can do at the moment. We've got our fields here growing slowly. Hopefully this uh, snow doesn't affect it too much. Uh, chickens have still got food. Our greenhouse is still doing their thing. Honey's still coming in. Eggs are still coming in. We should get these eggs. Uh, out of the out of the snow um, coming over through here these fields are all ploughed, copy ploughed, ready to go lime to fertilise stage one um, yeah there's not much we can do I guess I was thinking I was just going to head down and have a chat with Mark and see how he's settling in Luckily someone's been over here and taken care of these roads, the snow on the roads. Yeah, Mark's home. It's good to see. But he's got a good pickup. I wish I could have a pickup on that. Alright. What's he got? Like a, um... Toyota? Land Cruiser? It is. Bloody lucky man. Lucky man. He's changed her in the back. Ooh, Mark. 19th of February, 01 his birthday. He's 20. 20 years old. Alright, well I'll go and have a chat with Mark. Uh, um, we're probably going to skip through this month. There's not much we can do. Uh, we're sort of just waiting on some prices. Lettuce, tomatoes, strawberries, all that sort of stuff to go up a little bit more. Now uh, lettuce is sitting at three and a half. Should be more above four. Tomatoes, uh, 1700 should be above two. Strawberries, uh, 800 ish, they should be above a thousand. So, I don't know. We'll um, skip through the day and um, see what happens. We might make some sales tomorrow, but I'm going to go in and have a chat with Mark, see how he's doing, and um, catch you guys later on. Right here guys, I come back home, decided against skipping through uh, January. So I'm feeling the prices are going to drop a little bit, but come back home, dropped off our pickup, grabbed our uh, John Deere. I've got our auto loading trailer on the front, and I've leased two other ones just to get through this stuff a little bit quicker. Um, snow is a little bit of a concern, but we should be okay. Um, I'm going to try and get all the tomatoes on in one go come back, we'll grab the strawberries, grab the lettuce, and uh, we'll see how we go. Oop. I don't know if I'm going to make that turn now. Yeah, there we go. Just. Right. Do we strap them down? I think we're going to have some more coming through. There we go. I don't know how many we've got in total. That should be it, I think. Okay, uh, can I unload? There we go, let's reload these. Right, try and get all these on. I think we're gonna need more than one trailer. There we go, 288, so that's it for there. Strap them down. Get some more tomatoes here. I don't know if we're going to need all three trailers at the moment, but we'll see how we go. Grab that one extra. I think that'll be it for get yeah, that trailer's full. Which must be two stacks. Get the second lot. Strap that down, and I think that'll be why are the ones at the front disappearing. Did they disappear, or is that just a? Oh, they've disappeared. Oh, they might have loaded onto that rear trailer. 
Anyway, let's um, head off and get these sold. I'm going to drop our speed down right down to 20. Just because... Um, this snow is slidey. makes it harder to control everything. Makes a bit of lag too. We'll put our hazards on. Hoping that trailer, the middle trailer, actually loaded some of the ones off the front trailer. Um, they load nothing. I don't know. Because there's nothing available, so they may have disappeared. Hoping they did. Rock swing straight in over here. Huge amount of tomatoes coming in. Hope you can actually use all these. Uh, if you can't, that's not my problem. Let's unload that. Now let's see. Uh, there's nothing we can auto load for that rear, the middle trailer either, so I don't know. Don't know if those other ones just. Oh no, they've reappeared now, have they? No, they haven't. No, they haven't reappeared. Hoping they didn't just disappear. Otherwise, that's money that we've just lost for no reason, really. Let's get all these sold as well. That's 22,000. Maybe put a little bit more. Back a bit. I think we're just missing those front ones. It's a good amount of tomatoes. But hopefully she can use them all. Come on, get it in there. And nine. So that was, was that thirty-one thousand. Really, might as well say thirty-two thousand. That's what we had both together. That's, that's pretty bloody good. All right, let's um head back. Not going to have as many that lettuce in the middle there. I think it's lettuce in the middle, isn't it? Not as many lettuce. haven't quite got it growing as quick I think um, strawberries grow the quickest then the tomatoes and then the lettuce so yeah I don't think we're gonna have a full I only have one full trailer load here I'm gonna drop that off just because we don't need to take all of them if we don't need to That's um, not even going to be a full trailer load, which is fine. We'll probably load strawberries up on the other two trailers. I'll have to have a look to see where they're going. Um, lettuce. Grocery Mart 3.5. Uh, grocery Mart 9 so they've both gone the same place, so I guess we might as well. Right, we'll get the lettuces on here. The lettuce, I should say. Sorry, I keep saying lettuces, I know. Um, put some strawberries on top. We'll get strawberries on the other two trailers, and we'll rejoin everybody together. One more on here. Okay, perfect. So we'll park this guy up over here. Give ourselves plenty of room to be able to back onto each other. This is going to be a decent load. Hopefully, some decent income again. Hook you up, drop that last one off. Probably could have left these two attached, but uh, just to be safe. So we've got 164,000. We need to work out um, what we're going to need for 
decent cow pen. They're not that cheap. We've got heaps of strawberries in here. We have to do more than more than one trip of strawberries, I think. Sure. Something there, so I think we do. Yeah, we've got plenty. Be a full trailer load just out of this greenhouse, I think. Wait for the respawn. So 10,000 litres. Should get 15,000 litres each trailer. Ah, okay. Uh, unload. So right. Reload. That it now, that might be it. Right, strap them down. Let's double check, make sure. Yeah, that's it. We are going to need to come back for a second trip with these strawberries. Alright, done. Probably could have left that trailer back because we can join them like this. It might be a bit easier doing it this way. Any of them one at a time. Right. Hatch that one. Pop that one off. Oh god. It's certainly going to be an interesting trip. Three full trailer loads of. Well, two full trailer loads of strawberries and some lettuce as well. This should get us, well, we should get well above 200,000. Let's hope a quarter of a million dollars. That'll be even better. All right, it's just a bit, a bit of a shame that it takes them so long to respawn. Maybe I need to just drive away a little bit and then let it do its thing. Should be it. I oh, know, still 5,000 litres left in there. Wow. Right, now that should be it. Yeah, that's it. Perfect. We're not going to fit this whole one on here, so it might be another trailer load yet after this. Hope this uh, grocery mark can take all these. thousand litres, I don't think there's going to be that much left in that greenhouse, so we may just have one trailer to come back to. Yeah, 5,000 plus what's out the front. Alright, this is maybe a little bit laggy too. I don't know how this is going to go. trying to sell these two. Swing around to the left. Well, there's much traffic out. The snow, which is a bonus. Might probably stay at home, doing the smart thing. Except for me, obviously. Oh, wow. This is going to be interesting delivery. go around the front and we'll grab a um, screenshot of course. Now, what is that? Is that a random gate? Why is there a random gate or something placed here? No giants didn't update the map. Did they update the map and put in a random gate for no reason? Possibly. These giants after all. God knows. Get the other side of this fence. Monster. 
wants to load. Alright. Um, can't click on it, but that's definitely not meant to be there. Alright, let's drive around the back. We'll have to check on um, just equipment to see what's going on. Is there anything worthwhile looking at? Uh, tip side of the left. Left, left, left. Good. I think we should just be able to unload one trailer at a time. Very tight through here. I think we have to dump it off down to the left here. those there. Roll forward and then we can unload these ones once they're finished selling. Looks like they're partially selling too. Right, last trailer. And money's going up. We get 250,000. Well, the lettuces might save us. Lettuce, I should say. Yeah, look at that. The lettuce will save us. Hope you guys are ready for some more strawberries. We've got more coming. Thanks make sure that one gets sold. I don't think they get sold when they're upside down. What are you up to? 233,000. 69,000. Wow. Who says greenhouses aren't profitable? Absolutely awesome. Alright, so we're going to have to head back. Um, slow care. We will return both of these and other auto loading trailers and just use our own. I figure there's no point buying another two. We can do it just using our trailer one trip at a time, but it's going to take us forever if we do it that way. Just a little bit more of strawberry, so we may get about 240,000. I don't think we're going to break the bank what we have left. Alright, let's go into our least equipment. Why is there still one there? Owned. Okay. Uh, okay, I must have brought one at least one. Oops. Alright, well, we sold one. Turned one. Just a little bit of extra money, which isn't a bad thing. Know what it's trying to auto load. Yeah, I said there was stuff there when there wasn't. All right, let's um, shame it's not a little bit bigger area. I think there's definitely gonna be more coming out. That lag, yeah, another couple of thousand liters, another four more pallets. Actually, one day. Yeah, there we go. That should be it, I think. Yep, that's it. So not too much in this well, third and final load, I suppose. Um, honey eggs are still out in the weather. They're going to have some frozen eggs. Can't move them until they're a full pallet, otherwise I won't continue to fill them up. Right, so it was me and Mark did have a bit of a chat. Still unsure as to what we're going to do as far as um, cows go. Both leading towards the Angus cows, but 
need to save up a lot of money yet. Those fields down there are ready to go. I think if we can plant soybean next year, or this year I should say, um, get those harvested, get that sold, then towards the end of the year um, we can look at working out what we're going to do um, and hopefully having enough money to be able to purchase good quality, decent size cow barn. Get these in, ready to go. Let's have a look at sales, nothing there. We look at prices of cow barns. Uh, 75,000 just for the standard one, which holds 15. 154,000 which holds 45. 518,000 which holds 80. And 722,000 which holds 80 as well, but it's got the uh, auto feeding robot storage at the back, I think. Yep. Yeah, these ones don't have the storage, so. Right, well, that was sold. That was just about 8,000. A little bit less than 8,000, so that's not too bad. We've got just under a quarter of a mil. Um, honey's not good till March. Eggs in November, December. And eggs are a decent price. 67.50 roughly. Uh, what are they sitting at at the moment? Yeah, three grand. Half what we should be getting, I think. Then again, as I said, I think Giants may have um, changed prices. Alright, well. Oh, it's only 9 o'clock in the morning, but I'm a bit tired, so I might head home. Um, there's not much else we can do, really snow around. We've got the grass up there that needs to be cut, turned into hay and silage again. Um, can't sow anything just yet. Can't really go up and cut that grass while the snow's around. So I may just have to take uh, the rest of the month off. Come back next episode and look at doing some um, hay bales, some silage bales, all that stuff. And um, Work out where we're going to store them. We're going to need a shed to store them in down here somewhere, which will mean part of that field. Something's some built in the ground. Part of that field um, down there, field 51, I think it is. Part of that field will have to be turned into some sort of shed for some storage for some bales and stuff. So, I don't know. I love to look at the, the graphics snow on the tyres. But um, yeah, right here guys, we'll um, just gonna go inside, have a bit of a rest. See you guys here in February. If you guys enjoyed this one, as always, smash that like button. Leave a comment, let me know what you think of this series so far. If you've got any ideas and suggestions, if you guys are new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet, guys, please do so. Big Bruno, thanks for watching. See you again soon.